Snack Tackers. I'm Jason, and with me as always is Andrew. Now, you may have noticed that the plate is gone again, and we have a lovely treat for you that I guess again utilized the plate before we could put the thing on. I mean, it's on the plate, but we couldn't put it on for your viewing pleasure. So, we have a product that has, uh, you know, bogarted the plate, basically. Again? But our responsibility, can, can we get an update on that? We have not lost the plate. So our responsibility is still a okay. No, our responsibility is although our garbage. responsibility is garbage because we still don't have the receipt for this one. This was during the uh, I'm going to call the Great Walmart Apocalypse. Apocalypse. The Great Walmart Apocalypse, which is where we forgot the receipt. Just so call it Wa- yeah, yeah, that's that's a lot nicer. Walacalypse. That sounds great. No, it doesn't. They all sound very poor. Apparently, making Walmart into an apocalypse that it isn't already is difficult. Mark Pocalypse. Linguistically. Mark Pocalypse. Anyway, the product we have is a Walmart exclusive, so its great value is the brand. It is cheeseburger onion rings. Whoa. Doesn't that sound delicious? It is. Sounds Seasoned good. ground beef, cheddar cheese, and onion in a golden coating. Gold. Uh, I like gold. What? <laughs> Do you not like gold? That just seems so random. You said golden coating. Okay, I like gold. Uh, I'm ignoring that one. Moving on, we purchased these at Walmart because they're Walmart exclusive. We do not know the price, although if I had to guess, it'd say like four ninety nine or something. Four ninety nine sounds right. It comes with a pound of whatever's inside here, which is the onion rings, cheeseburger onion, cheeseburger rings. onion rings. Doesn't come with doesn't come with the sauce on the. Doesn't side. come with. It's just ketchup. Not like a. It's not like a mythical sauce. It's like Ooh, I didn't say that red sauce, babe. I didn't say mythical. I was just saying it doesn't come with any sauces. Controversial question: Is ketchup a soup? No, because tomato soup exists. Yeah, but if you add vinegar tomato soup, you would it's, be creating think, ketchup. I don't think it's watery enough. I think, I mean, unless you have really, be a soup. If the ketchup is bad enough. I mean, the parameters of soup is just a liquid. There's That's all. So you're saying that orange juice is orange soup? Orange soup. Listen, this one, this one actually goes out to a, a director that I knew uh, called Jeremy Thiebig. Great guy. Uh, he has posed the... The, 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 the philosophical question that all things are just soup. When you sweat, you're soup. Dude, our body's 70% water soup. You're soup. And then I know, huge tangent, but um, uh, anything you want to say about the box, anything popping out at you, it's nice green. I do love the nice green. It does really give off that neon vibe, which they're trying to go for a late night. Late night craving. Which... Would you look at that? It's not late night, though. I know that we always film at night. This is not crazy no, late. No, actually, it's just getting darker. Soon. That's right. Um, We're not telling you what time. I will, ad- I will admit the great value right there is a bit jarring. It is jarring. Re- they could have made it neon. They got this really nice packaging, I feel like, and then they dropped the well, ball. Well, it's Walmart. Yeah. Um, I'm super excited, though, because onion ring is my favorite type of appetizer, and I love burgers. I'm bringing them out here. This is what they look like on our plate, which I'm keeping from falling. Just kind of touching them, basically. Well, all right. I wanted you wanted to use our plate. There you go. Yeah, yeah, you. yeah. Just so they can get a. There you go. Uh, put it behind. Them. There's really not much more to say. They uh, look like onion rings. They smell. Onion. They onion-y. smell very oniony. So, J- well, like onion rings specifically, though, which uh, yeah. does not smell soup. Smell super oniony. Because once you cook soup. Once you cook onions, it loses a lot of its aromatics. Uh, it releases it to whatever it's being cooked Ooh, into. Wait. That's why people sweat their onions, and then the smell is very oniony, and the the broth or the oil gets very oniony. But the onions themselves lose a lot of their uh, aromaticness. I'm beginning to taste cheeseburger. Well, you darn again smell. not tasting. I'm beginning to yeah. smell cheeseburger. This is like the third time. I'm beginning to smell cheeseburger. That's because yours is a little rip there. Mine doesn't have that, and I only smell onion. No, Here's no, mine. no. It kind of smells like a certain restaurant that does stuff with cheeseburgers and tacos. <laughs> well, let's give it a try. One, One two, two, three, three snack, snack attack. attack. I almost forgot our phrase. Mmm. Oh, wow. Tastes like cheeseburger? Here's what I'll say. Don't really taste the onion. It does taste like cheeseburger. In a very specific way that companies, chip companies, and, well, mainly just chip companies, uh, make things taste like cheeseburger in that it tastes like the toppings of a cheeseburger. 
It tastes like mustard and ketchup and a little bit but of there's onion. A, there's real beef in here, so... Right, there's real beef, but it's... The beef isn't giving any flavor. Yeah, all the other... But that's not to say that they're recreating what chips do. It's just the beef is and not... And like the dill pickle, too. It just does... It's just that the ground beef is underwhelming, which is not an issue. I will say these are pretty good. These are amazing. Will I admit, for how much it smells like an onion ring, it does not taste... There's no onion flavor. Very minute. It's still there, but not much. And there's none of that onion ring texture, you know, that kind of elasticity you get from the cooked onion? There's none of that here. There's I mean, a little cross-section, I don't if, know. If, if, if you had just oh! if, if they called these... That's gonna be loud, in the mic. If they had called these cheeseburger bite rings... Then, then, yeah, I, I would, and, and they didn't tell you that onion was in it, I wouldn't be shocked. I would be like, yeah, cheeseburger bite ring. This is, this is my go-to appetizer now, if they need, if they make these elsewhere. Yeah, um, but because it says onion ring, I was expecting something different. It still stands it's on not its bad. own. It's, it's, it is not bad, I will say. I know that I, I frequently, uh, am down on a lot of the products that we try. This is not bad. Uh, it's something. It's not the best for an onion ring, but it's great for what it is. Well, let's uh, let's give our snack tech yas or pass. Snack attack yas. Snack tech yas as well. Uh, I I'm enjoy finish. it. I'm gonna finish it. Leave it alone. Jeez, you see this? You turn you turn your eye on a product that he likes, and boom, it's gone. Well, uh, what would you rate it out of ten? Like a nine. Nine out of ten. I'm giving this an eight. It's uh, there's room That's for fair. improvement. I feel like for sure, which is why I didn't. Give I feel it like a if 10. you homemade this idea, you could make a better one. Uh, that which, would take a lot of time, which I a lot of effort. I've noticed there are videos of people. yeah, there are videos of people doing this. Uh, I don't know if it's in response to this or not. No, because it was years ago. Well, then, uh, yeah, there are people who who are doing this. I mean, it's probably not an original idea, uh, but it's pretty good. But as always, we ask around here: Would you buy, buy it, again? it again? Yes, I would buy it again. I would, I would also buy these again. Um, party. They're pretty good. They're, right. they're, yeah, they're great for a party. And that's yeah. what they're, that's, I think, what they're intended to be. Or if, yeah, because it says late night craving. Or you're sad, you're alone, and you, you're, you're sad eating, and you eat the whole thing. Yep. If you're sad, buy these. Like, nuts. Uh, I mean. Yeah. It's, it's intended probably for a whole group of people, or just one sad, lonely person. One sad, lonely person. Which probably isn't you. Because you're awesome, viewer. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, all the fun YouTube stuff. And we'll see you in the next one. Peace.